All right, so here's my office and let's take a walk inside and see what we can find. Okay, so I'm gonna give you guys a quick little room tour of what this space looks like and how I've decorated it and made it kind of my own little area. But over here, we'll start with the ugly side, but um, right here is a Chicago poster that I hung up. I'm a, a Chicago native, I was born in Chicago, so uh, that's just kind of a, a piece of me. But here's some Hobby Lobby decor. Uh, this is what I hang my coat on in the uh, cold months, which is usually a long time. It's like cold nine months out of the year here in Ohio, so it's crazy. Um, also, I got this cheap dollar store clock here that is so loud. Every time I go to film in this space, I have to take the battery out of the clock so that it's not as loud, but it ticks really loud. Kind of annoying. All right, over here, this, this is a simple cabinet that I store a lot of stuff in, but whenever I go to these like children's ministry conferences or youth conferences or anywhere that I can get some free stickers, I put these stickers on here just to kind of decorate this cabinet from being a bland, ugly square cabinet. So this is a way I've kind of dressed it up uh, with just some of these different decals and stickers. Uh, up there, some old Vacation Bible School tins and curriculum. Right here is the Passion of the Christ movie poster. This is an old one, it was made in 2004, but uh, that movie means a lot to me because when I saw it, it was kind of like a, an awakening where I was like, oh man, you know, I need to do more for Christ because of what he did for me on the cross and that kind of speaks to me a little bit, but uh, yeah, Passion of the Christ movie poster. Okay, right here, this is a desk that I built uh, myself uh, with wood that I just got from uh, Lowe's and painted it up to make it look a little bit industrial like but uh, yeah so it's just some three-quarter inch plywood and then that is some inch inch and a half inch and a quarter uh, thick pine uh, that I put together with some wood glue and that was actually really easy to do you don't have to have a whole lot of carpentry skills to put that together um, over here on this wall is Iron Man. Now, a lot of people think, oh, why put an Iron Man decal in your office? Well, one, I'm a big superhero fan. I like superhero movies. Two, I can always spin it as there's a Bible verse uh, about iron sharpening iron. And, well, I'm an Iron Man. So, yeah, Iron Man decal there. Uh, Fathead decals. Um, over here is just an Ikea uh, furniture. Uh, store some of my other stuff. That laptop does not work. It's broken. I dropped it. Now I use it as a paperweight. Over here are some movie posters uh, from some of my YouTube videos. Some of these short films that I've made. Live Again, uh, What I'd Say, Good Friday, Jesus Saves. And uh, yeah, just check out my channel. You'll be able to find these movie posters or these movies in there. Um, they're really good. Um, it's been a while since I made one, actually. I need to make another one. Uh, over here on the windowsill is a Moses, uh, a Moses statue that I went to a place in uh, Pennsylvania, Lancaster. Sights and Sounds Movies, um, movie theater. Uh, they have awesome productions for a theater if you're into that kind of thing. Uh, over here, some more movie studio decor. This whole office has a movie cinema theme, uh, so that's where these came in to play. Uh, Hobby Lobby, you can pick these up at Hobby Lobby. Movie, there's that, some more movies decor. Uh, I do run a HP 27 inch pavilion monitor there. It's hooked up to this HP uh, laptop. I am a Mac guy, I'm a Mac user, but there are a couple programs that I use for work that are only PC based, so I still have to run one of these. It wasn't an expensive laptop, it's just a cheapo. Uh, some Bibles there, some writing utensils, of course. And let's see what else. Oh, up here. Mm -hmm. 10th Avenue North. I got to uh, have lunch with 10th Avenue North, a Christian band, one of my favorite Christian bands. And this is a poster that they autographed 
Uh, but yeah, I got entered into a, a giveaway and was able to uh, go to one of their listening parties where they just released a new album and you sat with them and listened to it. Um, and it was a kind of an intimate setting. There wasn't too many people there, but I was able to talk with them and have uh, lunch. And I talked to the lead singer as he uh, was telling me about a song that he wrote uh, while he's eating sun chips. Yeah. Uh, guitar, this has some more decoration. This is my calendar for scheduling out our uh, rotation for teachers and stuff. Just some uh, fancy drawings uh, that kids have made me being a youth pastor. Uh, kids send me their artwork all the time, so I'm hanging up here in my office. But, uh, also, just a quick little poster here. Pray right now uh, from a church over in San Antonio. Community Bible Church, a great church in San Antonio. If you're looking for a church, check that one out. But uh, one of the posters that they gave me. But yeah, so this is my office here for my office tour. Now, the reason I wanted to make this video was because I'm getting ready to remodel this office and completely change it over. I'm gonna paint the walls and uh, go with a kind of a different uh, decor, but I wanted to remember what this uh, office looked like because I've had this particular style for about five years. Uh, also, I, on YouTube, I didn't see a whole lot of movie cinema office tours, so I thought, well, why not make one in case somebody's interested in this and maybe it'll inspire them if they're looking to get some ideas to decorate for that particular thing. But yeah, this is it. All right, guys, well, thanks for watching this office tour video, and until the next video, be creative.